apart from the details of what exactly happened, what does it tell us about the need for regulation and why don't we have regulation? We've been talking about it forever, Democrats and Republicans. How pressing is that need? How can we get it done? You know, David, a lot of people have compared this to Lehman. I would compare it to uh, Enron, the uh, smartest guys uh, in the room, not just financial error, but certainly from the reports, uh, whiffs of uh, fraud, stadium namings very early in a company's uh, history, vast explosion of wealth that nobody quite understands uh, where it comes from. I think the regulatory community ought to draw two lessons from this. One, if we had a few fewer economists and quants and a few more forensic accountants, running around. I think it would help us uh, detect what was going on in countries and in uh, companies. The more I watch, the more that field of forensic accounting seems to me important. And the other is, I think we ought to have a rule in everything that touches finance, that everyone who has anything to do with it in a position of responsibility has to be entirely away from the office away from their phone, away from the, any uh, device and connection to the system for a week or two uh, continuously each year. And I suspect that that would be very helpful in causing some of these problems to come to light uh, sooner. But absolutely. But I think this is probably less about the complexities of the nuances of the rules of crypto regulation and more about some very basic financial principles that go back to financial scandals that took place in ancient Rome.